Hi everybody, welcome to the M Word at Balance Nutrition. I'm Marie. Um, we are going to be adding a chicken, a ground chicken breast patty to our meal prep this week. What I'm going to be putting in that ground chicken breast patty is some kale and some feta cheese. I'm gonna show you in just a minute. So I have um, some cut up, it's probably about two and a half pounds of chicken breast here that I'm gonna put into the food processor. Um, I also have our feta cheese. I have some crushed red pepper. You guessed it, guys. <laughs> you guessed it, guys. Like grenades. <laughs> I was waiting for him to say something. <laughs> um, the garlic powder, two eggs, some um, onion powder, pink Himalayan salt, and then I have the almond flour in the background because that's what's gonna help to hold it together with the egg. I also have um, the kale up here that I'm gonna put into it as I'm um, grinding up or grounding up the chicken. All right, hold on. Okay, so everything pretty much went in the processor and I processed it, processed it for, <laughs> for about a minute and a half. Um, the only thing I didn't put in there was the almond flour and it's a third cup of almond flour so I'm just going to pour that in the bowl now and then I'm just gonna mush it together, right? Mix it up real good. And then what I'm going to do is make it into eight separate little balls, right? Kind of get them as even as possible. And um, then I'll make those into patties, all right? Okay, so here are the eight um, chicken patty balls. I already have a skillet heated up with about a tablespoon of um, olive oil and then um, I'll do the first four and then I'll probably have to add the other tablespoon of olive oil for the uh, last four. Uh, I tried to get them as even as possible. You know, there might be one that's a little bit smaller than the other, but it's okay, it's no big deal. That's yours. <laughs> Renee already said that was mine, but whatever. They look really yum and they smell really good too. So I'll show you what I do. Okay, so I have them in the skillet now. When um, I have them brown on each side, I am going to go ahead and put them in the baking dish and I'm gonna put them in the oven for about 20 minutes. Because it's chicken and it's a thicker, a little bit of a thicker patty, I wanna make sure it's cooked thoroughly. So I'm going to um, do them, you know, cook them here on the pan and then go ahead and cook them in the oven. Okay, well. so here they are. I'm gonna place them in the oven, like I said, for about 15 minutes. Um, I'm gonna put them at like, 350 only just I don't want them in there too long because I really don't want them to dry out but I do want to make sure that um, they are thoroughly cooked so 350 for about 15 minutes all right guys while Marie's making the chin chicken patties I went ahead and put together our sides um, roughly two small bell peppers the one at the very end is flying solo but uh, <laughs> one and a half ounces of um, I guess you can say carrot sticks and another one and a half ounces of uh, snap peas. And then we're gonna actually put the chicken patty over the greens, right? Yeah. The greens. And then I'm fixing to put in um, our homemade ranch, which is just uh, this non non fat Greek yogurt with the powdered ranch dressing. Yep. With the powdered ranch seasoning. Let me get it. Seasoning. Okay. And then uh, how much of this are we gonna put in there? Uh, just the two ounces. Two ounces? Okay. And so uh, we add this hidden valley wrench. So two tablespoons of that. Throw it in this big bad boy right here. Stir it up. And boom. Guys, this ranch is the bomb.com. Much better than anything you're going to find pretty much in the store. Um, we've, we've, we've tried a few different ones. And uh, doing it ourselves has been not only beneficial, but the taste is just so much better. So hope you guys like it. It said, eat in color, taste the rainbow. I just love all the red and the orange and the yellows and the greens and I guess the whites for the ranch, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, so here are the finished dishes. They're so amazing. <laughs> we already tasted one of the um, chicken patties and OMG, they are really good. And like I said, I only put them in the oven for a little while just to make sure that they were thoroughly cooked, right? And um, they are still really juicy after I pulled them out. They are really yum, guys. Um, if you try this recipe, 
please give us some feedback. Give us a thumbs up if you liked it. Um, if you changed it, let us know. Let us know what you did different so we can try to do the same. Um, also, if you haven't already subscribed to our page, please do so. Thank you so much.